Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Lenard Thornton Jr. I also go by TJ, and I'm the Senior Business Program Manager for Workforce Development here at Delmarva Power and also at Atlantic City Electric. I'm an 11-year employee currently serving in my fourth different role at the company. I am also a full-time student enrolled at Wilmington University studying to complete my degree in organizational management with an estimated completion date of late 2022, early 2023. My current role, what I do is I create programs that provide an alternative path of employment here at Demarva Power or at one of our contractors of choice in the utility industry. I leverage my relationship with both internal employees and also our outside partners to create, fund, run, execute, and complete these programs from beginning to end. Our programs involve both as kids at the high school level and young adults with a special focus on our underserved communities. I've been serving in this role for approximately a year now. And before that, I worked, spent the previous 10 years on the utility side of the business, both in meter reading and also in our natural gas department, serving as a mechanic operator. My biggest takeaway and the, what I would like to impart with you guys is the importance of setting goals for yourself and career mapping. Now, when we think, think about goals, a lot of times people like to think a five year, 10 year goal. I personally like to think about your goal setting in smaller bites only because your goals may change from year to year and that is okay. When I first started at the company, I was employed as a meter reader and it was a temporary position. Position was lasting 18 to 24 months at the most. So my immediate goal was to me to find another home inside the company. I knew that I had that amount of time to transfer out of meter reading and find a full-time position. Within a year, I was able to transfer and land in our natural gas department where I spent the next eight years. Now at that point, my goals were simply to advance and become a lead in the department. Um, and at that point, I, I worked to those goals. My short-term goals also included personal development, which is something that I really think is really important that everyone should always be doing. Now, personal development can look different depending upon who you are and where you work. So here at Delmarva Power and personal development, man, being a part of organizations outside of your job, we do have those. Just like in high school, you guys, the primary function is for you just to go to school, but then you also have things like maybe a chess team or maybe a math club, a drama club. We have those same things here at Delmarva Power. There are a lot of them are focused around safety. A lot of them are also focused around personal development, excuse me. So during my time in the gas department, I made a point to join every committee that I can and try to learn something from them to develop myself as a person and as an employee. The way that, the reason I said also to take your goals and mark them in smaller bites because they're ever changing, the goals that I had started to change as I progressed in the gas department. After about my seventh year, my goal changed and decided that I wanted to try to become management to have a bigger say about how the gas department was ran altogether. There were some changes that I would like to see. So I set out to do that and I did that. Um, became a supervisor and worked in that role for about 18 months. Again, during the time in that role, my goals at that point changed again. It went from wanting to become a supervisor to manager to being supervisor to taking this job here in workforce development. During my personal time, I did a lot of volunteering. I'm a very, very, very big proponent of mentoring and giving back to the community because I have mentors that gave to me when I was young. So because of that background and that personal passion, when this spot in workforce development was created, to me, it seemed like a perfect blend of still working in a utility field and having a larger opportunity to give back. So once that opportunity presented itself, I applied for the position, I got it, and that's what I've been working for the last 10 years. Excuse me, the last year, sorry. So my big takeaway is always have your goals set out in front of you, but always be flexible to realize that your goals may change as your career progresses. Thank you.